Good morning, happy new year. Oh my goodness, it's been a while since I've made a little quick video. It is actually cold right now and I do not like walking outside when it's cold. I even got some heated mittens um, for Christmas and I'm like, I'm too cold. So I'm just gonna be going to the gym. With that being said, happy new year. The new year is a time when everybody likes to make their resolutions as to what they're gonna to try to be a better person, be healthier, all that good stuff. I have, um, a couple of my resolutions are one, I wanna read my Bible more. Number two, I wanna to try to save more. And three, I'm gonna take my own advice and I'm gonna to try to take in more, um, um, more protein on a daily basis. And so, you know, I feel like every time that I'm seeing my patients, they're always giving me new ideas and new options for protein. I've done a video um, in the past on different ideas. Um, I have to be honest, I don't know if it's been posted yet, but um, I kind of wanted to do a little add to it. I, I know one of my favorite proteins is Gene Pro, and they've made another generation, and the amount of protein is now decreased, which is a little bit of a bummer because one of my protein hacks that I'd love to tell my patients about is just trying to make a protein, um, as I go grab my coffee cup, trying to make a protein shot as opposed to just um, having like a great big protein shake. So one of the newest proteins that I am just starting to try is one called Vital Protein. So I'm gonna change my little camera. And it's Vital Proteins um, Collagen Peptides. And just so that you guys know, I'm, I'm not getting paid for any of this stuff. This is just ideas that I've gotten from my patients that I like to share. So you can see for per scoop, it's 20 grams of protein. There's a bunch of collagen and then you have this whole amino acid profile. And um, what I do with this is I just put a scoop in my coffee. Now, I'm gonna be very honest with you guys. I, the very first time that I made it, I made my coffee, I put in two scoops of my vital protein, and what do you know, I um, had a bunch of um, loose bowel movements. <laughs> that is not what y'all wanna hear, but I think in the beginning, doing just two scoops might be um, maybe a little bit too much. And then it, I was joking about it with uh, my CRNA while we were operating. And she was like, oh, kitten, you need to go ahead and try to just let that, um, you got to do it, do it a little bit at a time. So she recommended that I just do one scoop for like the first week and then work my way up. Now you can see it dissolves completely. It didn't even change the color. It does make it a little bit creamier, but that's okay because I like my fat-free um, French vanilla. Which, by the way, there is like a shortage of French vanilla and or fat-free items. I don't know if it's something with the supply chain or what, but I cannot find anything fat-free. I can't find a fat-free creamer. I can't find a fat-free half and half. I mean, that is what the real pandemic is. I'm like, I need my fat-free creamer. There's literally one grocery store here near me that will have this fat-free creamer, which by the way, I need to go to the grocery store and get today. And whenever I go, I literally will buy three or four bottles. So um, let's try it. Tastes good, tastes good. So number one, what does this taught me? If you do two scoops of this collagen peptide and you have a problem going to the bathroom, maybe just starting off with two scoops will do you right. Number two, if that is not an issue, you may wanna start off with just one scoop Number three, um, this would probably be another good option for you if you're wanting to make a protein shot because again, you saw that it, it dissolves completely. Um, it doesn't mean that you can't also still do that with Gene Pro. Um, just put two scoops to make sure because with both of these products, the Gene Pro and with the uh, Vital Proteins, one scoop is about 10 grams of protein. So I would recommend you do at least two scoops, dissolve it a little bit of water and take a shot. Um, what is one other, um, oh, there's another new protein that's on the market too, and that's um, Fairlife Protein Drinks. I know that y'all have heard me sing the praises of Fairlife Milk, which I love, and let's see if I have some in the fridge. Do I need to go to the grocery store? 
Oh yeah, see? Yep, can you tell? I always have a bunch of Fairlife in the fridge. And um, they did a little thing. Um, I had to get the one with DHA. I always get the 2%. Um, anyway, um, let me see. So, um, but Fairlife Milk, they now have a protein drink. A lot of my patients really, really like that. And I've told them, I'm like, hey, if that's too creamy, just drink the milk. And they're like, nope, we love it. So, um, let you guys, let me know what your ideas are um, on different types of protein. Um, I'm going to be making another video here shortly just on um, how to reincorporate these New Year's resolutions so we can get to a happier or not necessarily happier, but definitely a healthier you for 2022. So try vital proteins, um, try making a protein shot, and um, let's get those New Year's resolutions going. Okay, bye.